Hello friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Rishav and I am here again with another new video. So in this video, I will discuss about the onboarding survey mail. So you guys are thinking that I am uploading this video so late, I know, but uh, I have lots of work to do, that's why this video is little delayed, okay. So don't worry, I will discuss everything and tell you every point that is mentioned in that survey mail and I will clear all your doubts regarding internship and onboarding, okay. So watch this video completely to understand everything in detail. So first of all, I will tell you the onboarding survey mail. So I will just read that mail first and I will show you the screenshot here so you can focus here, okay. So in this uh, survey, they mentioned greetings from company, congratulations for clearing the audit process. As we are starting the onboarding process for graduates of 2022, you have been mapped for our upcoming joining batch of 11th April 2022. So these things are written in this mail and they clearly told that your BGV is now cleared and your audit process is completed means your BGV verification is now successful and they want you to join soon. Okay. So that's why they send you this survey mail. So you have to fill this survey and tell them that you are ready to join the company or you want to do the internship. Okay. Also they mentioned in this survey mail that however as you have expressed your interest and availability to join company as an intern on 7th of March 2022, internship would start on 10th March 2022. So they mentioned that uh, if you fill the survey in yes of uh, internship, then your internship is going to be start from the 10th March. Okay. And uh, we would like to understand uh, from you if you can join company as regular employee or would you like to join after completing internship. So they are asking that you want internship means you have a requirement of internship in your college. Okay. So if you have internship requirement, then you can choose the internship program and after completion of internship, you can join the company. And also, if you don't want this internship and you want your salary soon, then I will recommend you to go with the onboarding process and don't choose the internship. Okay. And also they organized a session on 5 March 10 a.m. that I think you guys attended. So in that uh, session I get to know that they explained many things like uh, internship is not mandatory. Means uh, if you don't do internship it will not affect your onboarding. So many candidates are asking me that uh, can I decline the internship offer letter. So I will recommend you guys, you can decline the offer letter as it is not mandatory and not affect your onboarding of Elite. Okay. And uh, you can join on 11 April batch if you don't want to do internship, they tell in that session. Okay. So that is a very good thing that uh, they are scheduling your onboarding from 11 April. And uh, I will tell you that if you join on 11 April, then you will get your salary at the end of month means if April month is of 30 days then you will get your salary of 30 April and if it contains one more extra day means 31 April then you will get your salary on 31st April. Okay. So these things I want to tell you and most probably you will get the internship steam only when you join. And if you go with internship, you will get to know your stream also, okay. And uh, also PJP is not mandatory, they are telling. If you take internship, then you don't have to do the PJP. And also they mentioned that uh, offices are opening so might uh, work from home last when you join, okay. Means uh, if you join the company and they resume office uh, after 31st March, then you have to join office and this work from home will discontinue okay so now you understand that uh, if you join an internship or you will go with the onboarding process and uh, if uh, office resumes then you have to join in office and work from home will discontinue okay and also they are 
saying that onboarding survey link will be activated again means some candidates are facing issue with the survey form and not able to submit their response then keep patience they will again activate the survey link okay and uh, if you do internship your joining will be held in month of may okay and every month they are trying to onboard at least two batches okay so wait for the onboarding mail if you don't received it yet so these things i want to tell you in this video hope you guys enjoy this video and find this video helpful okay so now you understand that internship is not mandatory if you don't want to do internship you can just leave the internship and don't accept the internship offer letter and join company without internship it will not affect your hiring process and you can get many certifications after joining also so don't worry about this internship certificate okay so these things i want to mention in this video hope you guys enjoy this video and find this video helpful so i will meet you again in next video till then bye bye take care and best of luck for your future bye